Hello by watching this video, my name is Josh Pot, and welcome back to Alan Wake. In the last episode, we went ahead and left off right here in the middle of the cutscene, so I made sure to make sure to, like, pause immediately, so we go ahead and, you know, see all that. Did I just say make sure, like, twice in a row without, like, that was weird, but okay, whatever, you know, I've had plenty, I speak wrong all the time, so you know what, that it just adds to it all. I, I've always said, um, you know, the only language I, I only know one language, and it definitely ain't English, so, you know, it's whatever. Dang, how are you gonna have that big of a hangover? Self deception. I swore to quit drinking. That's crazy. Never had a hangover. That, that's crazy. I don't uh, I don't know how you feel, my guy. I'm sorry. But if it feels anything like a migraine, then I understand. Because the sunglasses part I definitely definitely get. Now I could keep my eyes open without feeling like a vampire in the sun. Yep, I've I've done that plenty of times with like migraines and stuff like that. Just need sunglasses just for the rest of the day. Painkillers picked up Wonderful, I guess. I don't know. I don't take medicine. I don't, I don't know how to. Best. The prospect of being awake started to seem bearable again. I don't take like, any medicine ever. I, I don't like it. So I just okay. <laughs> so I, I I've never had painkillers or anything. Definitely wouldn't have any around, just like laying around or anything like that. I haven't taken medicine in years, so I don't know There's how to. A message waiting for me on the machine. I don't know how effective they would be. I'm not blaming you. This is your friend. She's not doing your career any favors by trying to run your life like that. Okay? I'll talk to you later, Al. Watch the show. Uh, turn on the TV, I guess. Okay, what uh, what show? What, what did I do? Did I do anything interesting? Anything fun? The Harry... Is Harry Garrett show? <laughs> oh, I can focus. That seems a lot easier. Six books is a long time. He was a gloomy guy to spend all your working hours with. And it was a good run. But it's time to explore new things. My next book will be a departure from the old for me. You selfish bastard. Always thinking of yourself. Well, you've certainly given us a lot of entertainment over the years. And now that you mention it, Casey was a gloomy guy. Never had much luck with his love life with the lady. Was that autobiographical in any way? Yeah, no kidding. Casey's lady friends tended to die on him. With Casey, it was all about his pain. No, nothing autobiographical about that. I'm a happily married man. My wife is my muse. Well, congratulations. That's great to hear. So, how's the publicity tour been treating you? Good? Great. But I gotta say, I'm glad to be back home in New York. Did they dub over the video? Lots of parties and... to a fight with some paparazzi. Oh, man. Well, that guy was really in my face. I lost my temper. I know that wasn't cool. Well, you are famous for that temper. <laughs> they did a very good job, but I think they dubbed over that. That's a little odd. Well, your latest novel is called Instead of just having Stop. the mics. Now. I could be wrong, Get but... It. That means the two of you out there have it fun. Ladies and gentlemen, that's all we have for you tonight. I want to thank all our guests for the evening. Alan Wake, Sam Lake. What's more, do the face for a Sam. And our musical guests, Poets of the Fall. Thank you. At least I've been funny. I told myself I could live with that. I didn't say anything stupid, if that's what you want to know. Okay. 
Hey, Grumpy. You want an aspirin or something? Are you going to start with me about drinking now? You know what? Go back to sleep, Alan. Yeah, she was just concerned. She was actually being pretty cool about it, too. That's crazy. What? Now you can't even talk to me? Well, this morning I was angry because you said you'd be home at midnight and you showed up at 7 a.m. and passed out in mid-sentence. Now I'm over it. Are you angry? This goddamn tour. It's gotten out of hand. Oh, honey. It's almost over, right? We can get back to normal and we can start writing again. I'm sorry, honey. Alan, you're not thinking straight. Just take a shower and go back to bed, huh? Yeah, you're right, honey. I'm sorry. Once this is over, let's go away together. On vacation. Just you and me. Some peace and quiet. See, that's a man. That's a good that's a good man right there. Even though he is genuinely psychotic, but that's fine. That is perfectly fine. At least he has good intentions. Bright falls present today. Oh, wonderful. Somehow, Am I just still trapped the in the thing? Was the key to the cabin. I had to return to Cauldron Lake to save Alice. It would have been funny if all the lights just turned off and just everything was about to, to try to kill her. To finish this. I'm going to write an ending to the story in the manuscript on my own terms to make it all right. Why can't you just write it here? The last page is still in the typewriter. I need to read it first. Everything needs to be just right. Zane tried to cut some corners and it didn't end well. Okay, ready when you are. I'm sorry, Sarah, but I need to do this alone. Because Why would you take her gun? Why would you just point the gun at her? Close the door when I leave. Just go alone. Don't just point a gun at somebody. Just tell her. I think she would understand. See you later. See, this is what I mean by the psychotic part. She wasn't going to fight you on it. I bet if she, if she didn't say anything. Maybe she would have, but I don't think she. I. Oh, what? Why would she just. Got out, it was okay. Sunny. I inflict the switch of the clicker. Had it done this? I didn't stop to question it. I had to take advantage of the sunlight to get to the lake. On Zane's page, I had stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, about to use the clicker. That's where I was headed. Oh, uh, yes. Nice, warm, and sunny, you know. Only time this ever happens. How long is this drive? Because it's going to be nighttime by the time you get there, ain't it? Even though it's, that definitely shouldn't be the case. But it, it, okay, I get it. I guess maybe, probably not. But how did it get so bright after? Like... Alone, in daylight, surrounded by the beauty of the Pacific Northwest landscape, it was hard not to let doubt creep in one last time. I could still chalk everything up to a dream, a delusion. I had enough imagination to make up something like this. Having been in the cabin all this time, trapped in a story inside my head, gone mad from grief over Alice's death like Hartman had claimed, there would be no way of knowing. I told myself it didn't really matter. My course was set. And now I get to drive down a highway for 50 minutes straight. Great! Beautiful! Lovely! I, I love that! You know, perfectly fine. I, you know, I'd definitely much rather be driving in real life than I would be driving in a game, to be completely honest. Oh, God, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alan, I think you're. I think the um, you know, a night after night of barely sleeping much at all, and the one time you did sleep, you just drank a ton. So you know, I feel like you're probably not in the greatest shape. Around. You know, every time you slept, probably was not comfortable at all, to be perfectly honest. But you know what? I mean, it's not inhibiting your driving in any sense. Is there anything important this way? That feels like that there could be some, potentially something important this way, possibly like a manuscript page or something. Yes, no, maybe so. Am I a genius? Or am I just paranoid? Probably both. Probably, yeah, probably just an all and above question. Alright, wonderful. I will take some hunting rifle ammo, plus a hunting rifle. 100%. That's beautiful. I love that very much. Is this the way I was actually supposed to go? I think this is probably the way I was actually supposed to go. Okay, well, that works for me. Uh, no, or, or not. I don't know. Okay. No, this isn't the way I'm supposed to go. Okay. Am I genuinely able to, like, just walk this? That's crazy to me. I'm just so happy it's the middle of the day, so I don't actually have to worry about, you know, people trying to come out and kill me. That's so much better for me and everything else. Okay, wonderful. Where'd you... When did you lose, like, all the flashbang and all that stuff, Alan? You had that when I got into the uh, walkway, didn't you? Right? Am I wrong? Like, I understand why you lost most of the stuff between, like... Like, most of the time I understood why you lost the stuff. You had a storyboard explanation for it. This time you, didn't, you don't really have an explanation why you lost all your stuff besides the rifle ammo. I mean the uh, pistol ammo. Um, I'm, uh, you know, I 
don't think I was high on pistol ammo to begin with anyway, so I wouldn't have questioned it, but like, I don't know why you don't have the rest of your stuff at this point. That's a bit odd, but I'll definitely take the rifle the, the rifle and everything. I'm not going to complain about free ways to protect myself. That's wonderful. Okay, continuing down this path we go. I'm sure there's many different, like, little side things we can do. Like that barn, for instance, but I don't really feel like stopping at every single one, to be honest. I will. I, I'm going to have to stop at every single one, aren't I? Okay, yep, nope, not getting through that. That's great. Beautiful. Lovely. Perfect. You know, just drive backwards like an expert. Everything will be a-okay, -okay, Alan, if you go ahead and do that. Why is this a barn here? This feels very odd, not gonna lie. Is there a way in there? There's a coffee thermos. Because why not, I guess. Um, how am I supposed to get to Cauldron Lake now, though, without the ability to go through there? Was I going the proper way? I don't think I was. I think I was off the beaten path. I, I'm not quite sure. I guess let's go ahead and just try to, you know, sink this car and see how that works. Because it may work or it probably, probably won't, but, you know, it could. It could definitely work. Possibly. Probably not. I'll just run into the uh, gate thing really hard, maybe. Possibly. Or is it... Do I just go down this way? I wouldn't be shocked if I just go down this way. Like, just try to cut through. Let's go for it! Huh. Yeah, that didn't work out how I thought it would, and I lost all my progress. That's wonderful. Yeah, I don't... You're really gonna lose all your progress from that? Are you kidding me? We, we just... Are you serious, Al? Wait, you Yeah, I, I heard this whole spiel again. I don't know why I stopped for a moment to listen to it. I literally just listened to it. But are you serious? Just spawn me back to where I like last drove or whatnot. Don't send me hurtling off that thing. That's petty. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. That is so beyond messed up. All right, to the little rest area we go then, because I need to grab that. St I don't. Uh, did I pass it? Did I already pass it? No, I didn't already pass it. I was about to say, if I already passed it, then I'm not going back. This area, though, please. Thank you. Wonderful. Let's grab, grab this. Uh, well, I'll just go down first. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Don't crash. Okay, well, you're starting to crash. I no noise. Interesting. Oh, okay. There's the noise. There's the, there's the noise, and there's the damn. Great. Okay. The car's in a lot worse shape the last time, too, because, you know, I'm trying to rush it a little bit. But that's... Why would you just... Okay, I, I don't know why it's, like... Where else was I supposed to go? I guess that's my only other question at this point. Okay, well, that's just... Okay. This car is not going to be in good shape after I'm done with it. But that's okay. I don't need... Uh, can you make it up the hill, please? I don't know why you struggle so much going up that thing. I don't feel like it's that steep of a hill or anything like that. So she says, you know, I'm kind of I'm not supposed to go this way. There's definitely a way to go. Well, there wasn't any way to, for me to go down there, right? I'm not tripping with that. I, I, I'm pretty sure I'm not tripping with that. I could... I hope I'm not tripping with that. I could be tripping. I, I trip a lot in this game, I feel like. But okay, let's move on. I'll go another, like, extra three or four minutes. Because that was... That kind of sucked. I didn't want to... <laughs> I just fell off a cliff right there, you know? I, it's kind of unfortunate. Don't do that thing again where you jump off a cliff as well this time. You know, I thought I was doing this time... That time I was, like, I was going to be able to get back up. Because, you know, it looked like there's a ramp to very easily get back up if I wanted to. But apparently not. Apparently they decided not to let me have that. Okay, can I get into this truck and move it then? Or do I have to just get up and get around? Gonna have any words of dialogue or anything? Oh! Okay! Great! Touch me. There was a link between us. Always would be. I could feel its presence again getting closer. Okay. Was I not supposed to hit the thing? Definitely thought I was supposed to like okay, never mind. I thought I was supposed to, like, you know, ward it off or whatnot, but ap apparently not. Can I not do that either? I gotta go on foot from here on out? You best not make me go back on foot. It's nighttime? When did this happen? No. Back to my car we go. No, 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 no. Okay, y'all y'all cannot do that. Oh, never mind. Not back to my car. Alright, that's unfortunate. That would have been very helpful. I'm happy that I have the big light, though, still. I am very happy you carried that over from, you know, our last journey, Alan. That makes me feel better about myself. There we go. Wonderful. Let's get you out of the way, please. Thank you. Fill that up, and then we are a-okay right there. Just went straight up to night. I, I just walked, and it became nighttime. It's great. 
definitely something I thought well, that would happen when, you know, you just walk through a tunnel. It just goes from day to night in the, literally a flash. Can you press that clicker again? Clicker worked out you well for you last, well, last time. You better do it again, please. Okay, this, okay. Dark pressing for me wants to stop. Wait, this is a very short chapter. Okay, this is definitely the final chapter. Well, this is the final chapter, but it's a short chapter, which is cool. He could create the ending it wanted. The writer knew too much. He was too strong. And he carried a weapon left behind by Thomas Zane. Something that could hurt it. Now, the darkness was doing everything in its power to simply stop the rider from ever reaching Cauldron Lake and the dark place it came from. Dang, so now it's just trying to play keep away at this point. That's crazy. They just don't like me at this point. Can I get in that car, please? I would love a car. Can you afford to me a car? I like how you turn my light off. That's crazy. My one little form of protection, and you just take that away from me. That's unbelievably messed up. But I will 100% take a car. I feel as safe as can be in this car. You know what I'm saying? I feel untouchable at this rate. There's another car, too. I got backup plans. See, I got plan. Okay. It's not what I meant to do, but okay. Let's go ahead and ignore that. The car is still functional. Maybe. Possibly. Driving on the wrong side of the road, but that's okay. Alright, well, it depends. You know, who, know, who knows? Maybe, maybe we could. Maybe we're not in America. Even though we're definitely in America. Maybe we're not in America. Let's just go ahead and run you over, because why not? That makes me feel good about myself. That's a bright sign. Hello. Well, I'm very deep in this fog right now. Okay. Uh, is this a diner? What is this place? Hello? What's in here? I'm very curious about this place. I don't really remember ever seeing this in the game. Maybe this is my- oh, is that, is that a ramp? I jump off of? That's kind of awesome. I really hope that's actually the case. That is really dope. Okay, up through this little door, please. What's in here? Water. Okay, I- Okay, oh, the Majestic Motel. General information. Refundable $100 security deposit is required in, um, all reservations. No personal checks accepted. We also say, um, we take all major credit ca cards and bank cards. Checkout time is 10 a.m. No loud music, no pets. All right. Cool. Our vehicle per unit facilities registered. No visitors on, uh, premises. No exceptions. We hope- that's kind of weird. No visitors past nine. Shotgun ammo. I will take that. I will rather the shotgun, please. Thank you very much, game. All right. Even though I have more an ammo for the hunter, um, hunting rifle, you know, I'm not necessarily going to be thinking the smartest about that. But I think I'm going to end off this episode here, and we'll go ahead and continue to drive this car. Hopefully, the car will actually be here in the next episode. That's a little concerning, but hopefully we'll have the car in the next episode so we can go ahead and take that ramp. But other than that, I'd like to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed. Greatly appreciate it, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.